the beauty of the season is there hasn't been too many downs, right? I think our non-conference portion, we might have been 7-0 with a really big win over Vanderbilt, who was then 9. Um, I think that gave us the confidence to believe in us being a very good team. Uh, then we went into conference play, and I, I would point to the Clemson game as a game that gave us reaffirmation that we are a very good team because we beat then, I think they were three in the RPI. Um, you play Carolina, you play Virginia, arguably two of the top teams in the country who could win a national championship and you suffer a loss. And again, we go back to talking about the process. Um, not focusing on the result, but focusing on the process. There was parts of both of those games where I think we looked like a very, very good team. And the beauty of playing in the best league in the country is it's the platform for the postseason. There's not too much that we're gonna see moving forward that we haven't already seen in our league. Um, and then probably the part that's the most disappointing is the two back-to-back -back losses to NC State. Um, the Thursday end of regular season was probably the one that going back, removing the emotion from the night um, and taking a look at the two of the games a little bit more objectively or as objectively as I can as a coach. Um, Thursday we should have won. I thought that we missed two clear chances that could have separated us, but we didn't. Um, not that, and I, I guess I shouldn't say should, that's a tough word to you, should have won. We could have won. We had two chances that we absolutely missed, it's on us, and then we give them opportunities to win the game. And on Sunday on the day, um, I thought they were better. I thought they were better than we were. So we regroup, we don't get to the ACC Final Four, um, but I'm all about a silver lining and finding the reason behind why things happen. And I think that silver lining is that we get to recharge ourselves, rejuvenate ourselves, get ourselves back to um, being who we are. And I think that that's happened. I thought practice today was sharp. Um, some of them even had said to me, got on board, can we get back to practice again? Because we had given them two and a half days off, um, which was good, which was exactly what we needed to happen. Um, so I had a good session today and super excited about Friday. Uh, where we sit today is in a wonderful spot. I think these kids are, uh, they get to do what they love with who they love, right? And they show that every single day in practice and we show that every single day in games and, and I'm excited for Friday night.